Hello everyone and welcome to the Turfway Park Report for Saturday, March the 28th. Nine races tonight. Poly track fast. We start with Maiden Claimers going six furlongs in the first. Program favorites the eight Akira Storm and the six Sweet Chocolate. And they're off. Sweet Chocolate broke well from between horses. Up from the outside Akira Storm. Then thanks for saving me. Diamond Lulu on the rail is fourth. Two and a half back, it's Runaway Native, Au Contraire, then Silver Viking, and a big gap. Which way to the Argo is the trailer? Well bunched on the run down the back stretch. Sweet Chocolate between horses. Down along the inside, Diamond Lulu, Akira Storm up on the outside. Those three together into the turn, gap now of five lengths. Moving through from the inside, Silver Viking now takes fourth. Thanks for saving me fifth. Three more back to Runaway Native. Then from the inside, gaining ground, which way to the Argo? Au Contraire is the trailer into the stretch. Diamond Lulu on the outside, Akira Storm. Silver Viking in the center of the track. Late run from which way to the Argo? They're inside the final furlong. It's Diamond Lulu on the outside. Silver Viking, Akira Storm, Silver Viking. Wins it going away a length and a half. Akira Storm second. Then Diamond Lulu and which way to the Argo? Number two, Silver Viking wins the first under Victor Balon, trained by Ingrid Boak. 2380, 840, and $5. Akira Storm second, Diamond Lulu third, 9680. For the Exacta, the Tri 339.10, the Super 2261.60, six furlongs, very slow, 116 and 1. Second race, one mile claiming race, three year olds end up. Program favorites, the five, Newfound King, and the six, Fujita Five. And they're off. From between horses, Fujita 5 broke well with John Adams showered from the inside. Up on the outside, that's Lil Napoleon as they move into the first turn. John Adams showered Fujita 5, those three together. Lil Napoleon on the outside runs fourth. Then it's All Britain who takes fifth. It's Wine O'Clock sixth. Newfound King is seventh. Then it's a length and a half to Tower East, and it's a big gap to Worden Gordon Borden, the distant trailer, after a 25 and 2 opening quarter. John Adams is in front a half length. On the outside, Fujita 5 is second. Then it's or rather showered on the inside, who runs third ahead. Lil Napoleon is fourth, All Britain fifth. It's Wine O'Clock is next. Then Tower East, followed by Newfound King, and Worden Gordon Borden is still far back. 50 and one for the half and john adams has opened the lead has it now by a length and a half showered on the inside takes second up from the outside that's lil napoleon in third fujita five has dropped back in fourth moving up from the inside it's wine o'clock is fifth tower east in the center of the track late run on the outside from newfound king but it's all john adams has been in front all the way under Dylan Davis and has a seven-length lead over showered second. Late run on the outside from Tower East, but John Adams just wins easily, maybe 10 lengths. On the outside, Tower East got up for second over showered, then a photo. Dylan Davis sends John Adams to the lead, just wins easily, drew off. Uh, owned and trained by Ron Isbell, eight-year-old gelding, paid twenty-three dollars eleven twenty-five eighty. Tower East uh, ran second, showered was third, double two twenty-two sixty, exact a one eighty-two forty. The try four fifty-six thirty, and the super eight thousand nine ninety-three eighty. The mile one forty-one and three. Third race, starter allowance race going a flat mile. Favorites in here, the three tap Anna with Johnny McKee and the eight yard bird misfits under Alvin Jimenez. And they're off. From the outside, that's Knight Warden who breaks well. The inside tap Anna up between horses. That's Amazing Kitten. Then yard bird misfits and more than noble on the outside. 
into the first turn. The leader is now Amazing Kitten by a head. Knight Warden on the outside second. Yardbird Misfits third. More than Noble takes fourth length and a half. Tapana fifth. From the outside into sixth. That Salty Rim. Another length back to Charlie St. Gold and F from S. Lee Hunter trails. 24 and 3 for the quarter. Well bunched on the run down the back stretch. Down along the inside, still Amazing Kitten. Moving up from the outside, Yardbird Misfits. Night Warden right there between those two. Then it's a gap of a length. From the inside, more than Noble runs fourth. Gaining on the outside, Salty Rim. Followed by Tap Anna and Leek Hunter. Then Ephraim S. and Charlie St. Gold is the trailer. As they move for the stretch, there goes Salty Rim. On the outside, Tap Anna is now gaining ground from second. More than Noble on the outside runs third. Then from the inside, that's Leek Hunter, followed by Ephraim S. But Tap Anna is now drawing away. Tap Anna has a big lead over more than Noble. It's Tap Anna. Tap Anna wins it by seven or eight. Photo for second. Lee Hunter more than Noble with F from S. Number three, Tap Anna draws away the favorite under Johnny McKee, trained by Mike Maker. Three eighty, three dollars, two twenty. Lee Hunter got second in that photo. More than Noble third. Double sixty nine sixty. Exact of forty one sixty. To try eighty four sixty. The super six eleven. And the pick three two ninety two seventy. The mile in 140 and four. Fourth race, uh, optional claiming allowance race for the Phillies and Mares going a mile. The favorites, the three, did he mention my name with Dylan Davis? And the one, Kettle Twist under Alvin Jimenez. And they're off. From the inside, Kettle Twist and Julie's Jewelry. Both broke well. They're going head to head into the first turn. Hidai on the outside is now third. Then did he mention my name, Robin John's girl and distorted Alice. Midway through the turn, it's Kettle Twist in front. Now by a length, Julie's Jewelry is second. They ran the first quarter in 24 and 4. Two back to Hedai who runs third. Did he mention my name is fourth? Then Robin John's girl and distorted Alice. Down the back stretch, Kettle Twist leads it. Now just by a half length. Julie's Jewelry second, length and a half, Hedai third. Then did he mention my name, Robin John's girl, distorted Alice 49 and 3 for the half. Kettle twist ahead. Julie's Jewelry second, length and a half, Hedai third. Did he mention my name, gains from fourth, Robin John's girl the outside fifth, distorted Alice is the trailer, end of the turn. Down along the inside, that's still Kettle Twist with the head in front of Julie's Jewelry. Up on the outside, Hedai, Robin John's girl gains ground. Did he mention my name is still fifth and the trailer distorted Alice? It's Kettle Twist in front now by a length and a half. Here comes Robin John's girl on the outside gaining ground. Late run from Diddy mentioned my name. Kettle Twist, Robin John's girl. Kettle Twist holds on over Robin John's girl. Did he mention my name third? Then he died. Number one, Kettle Twist leads all the way under Alvin Jimenez. Trained by Mike Maker, a game winner. Kettle Twist 440, 322, 10. Robin John's girl second. Did he mention my name third? The double 1440. Exacta 1660. The try 2110. Super effecta 14460. Pick 3 9940. And the pick 4 1201 $1.80. The mile 141 and 1. Fifth race, six furlong maiden claimer scratch the two Wigginton. The favorites, the six a bit quick with Deshaun Parker. And the seven Hugh Hoofner, ridden by Malcolm Franklin. And they're off a bit quick. Broke quickly from the outside with Hugh Hoofner. Then along the rail, Brett's boy, followed by Halo on the lake. Then it's Mecky's launcher, and uh, Frankenstorm has already dropped way back. Frankenstorm 20 lengths behind already as they move down the back stretch. 
a bit quick is in front just by a half length Hugh Hoofner is second by two Brett's boy runs third gap of three more halo on the lake is fourth five more to Mecky's launcher and Frankenstorm far back 23 and two a bit quick is in front Up on the outside Hugh Hoofner right there in second now it's a gap of five back to Halo on the lake. Then Brett's boy into the stretch a bit quick. On the inside has the lead. On the outside, Hugh Hoofner. It's been these two throughout. Big gap back. Halo on the lake is third. A bit quick. Hugh Hoofner on the outside. These two to the wire. A bit quick. Now puts his head in front. And a bit quick gets there just by a head. Over Hugh Hoofner and Mecky's launcher up for third. Number six, a bit quick. The heavy favorite just gets there. Under Deshaun Parker, two in a row for Mike Maker. Hugh Hoofner second, Mecky's launcher third. Number eight, play the points. Was a late scratch, refused to load, and was a late scratch. Constellation doubles and pick threes with play the points. The winner, 280, 220, 210. The double, 720. Exacta 760, the try 4250, the super 23420, and the dollar pick three, ten dollars forty cents, one fourteen and one. Sixth race, six furlong allowance race, fillies and mares. Favorites, the uh, four, Mitia, and the eight, Soul Crusader. And they're off. Soul Crusader broke well, so did Mitia from the inside. Moving up between those two, Curious Ruth and Sweet Southern Dame. Down the back stretch on the outside, Soul Crusader, Mitia on the rail. Curious Ruth runs third by two. Marching Band moves up, takes fourth, Sweet Southern Dame fifth. Three more back to Path to Power, Martha Rose, and Awfully Angelic. A quick 22 flat opening quarter for Mitia, who leads it just by a head. On the outside, Soul Crusader is second by two. Curious Ruth runs third. Marching Band is fourth. Two more back to Sweet Southern Dame in fifth. From the inside path to Power moves up, then Awfully Angelic and Martha Rose into the stretch. Down along the inside, still with the lead. That's er, now, now Mitia has dropped back and getting the lead. That's Curious Ruth. Gaining on the outside, Sweet Southern Dame. Sweet Southern Dame runs by Curious Ruth. Path to power, it's Sweet Southern Dame. Sweet Southern Dame wins by four. Curious Ruth second, Path to power third. Number seven, Sweet Southern Dame under uh, Albin Jimenez, trained by Ben Colebrook, 560. 342, 20, long shot Curious Ruth second, Path to power third, the double 820, the exact is 7180. The try one seventy two twenty. The super two thousand four dollars, and the pick three fourteen ten. Running time one twelve and three. Seventh race maiden race. They're going a mile. Scratch the six. I'm better than good and the nine J. Favorites the two Grateful Life with Didiel Osorio and the four Henry Eight under Alvin Jimenez. And they're off. From the inside, Grateful Life broke well. Up between horses, that's Henry Eight, Fast Music. Then from the outside, Radar Love. Into the first turn, Grateful Life is in front. Goes a bit wide there. Moving through from the inside, Take Me to Hollywood. Then Henry Eight runs third by a head. Fast Music fourth. Two back, that's Radar Love in fifth. And a gap of eight lengths back to Naval Commander and Papete. First quarter, 25 and one. Grateful Life is in front, just a half length. Take Me to Hollywood is second. Henry eight on the outside, third. Two and a half to Fast Music, fourth. Radar Love is fifth. Then it's a gap of four more. To Naval Commander and a big gap back to Papete, who is the distant trailer after a half and 49 and 4. They're into the turn. Grateful Life is in front a length and a half. 
Henry eight runs second, take me to Hollywood third, Radar Love is fourth, Fast Music now runs a fifth, then Naval Commander and Papete into the stretch, Grateful Life in front, draws away now by two. Henry eight is second, take me to Hollywood third, late run from Papete, but it's Grateful Life who just draws away, then Henry eight, Grateful Life. Goes on to win by five. Henry eight second. Good late run from Papit to get third. Then take me to Hollywood. The favorite number two, Grateful Life, wins it under Didier Lasorio. Trained by Gary Sims for forty three dollars and two eighty. The price is Henry eight second. Uh, Papit came from far back to get third. The double fourteen dollars exacted twenty one eighty. The try thirty five sixty. Superfecto 18140, the pick three for a dollar, eleven fifty, and the pick five, sixty-four twenty, the running time one forty-one and two. Eighth race, six furlong optional claiming allowance rate. Favorites in here, the seven, DCF, Proud Mary, and the five, Tizzy B. Hut. And they're off. VCF Proud Mary broke sharply, but on the inside there goes Discreet Kiss. Moving up from between horses, guessed right, VCF Proud Mary on the outside. Up between horses, Tizzy B. Hot. Then we get Uptown Gal, followed by La Jolla Doro and Abby's Promises, the early trailer. As they move forward the turn, 23 flat for the quarter. VCF Proud Mary is in front. Has it by a half length. Now a length. Discreet Kiss is second. Up on the outside, Tizzy B. Hot. Between horses, guessed right. Abby's Promise moves to the outside. Gains ground. Then Uptown Gal La Jolla Doro trails. They're midway through the turn. The half goes in 47 and 1. The leader is VCF Proud Mary. Discreet Kiss. On the outside, Tizzy B. Hot. Center of the track, Abby's Promise. VCF Proud Mary is in front of Discreet Kiss. Tizzy B. Hot is gaining from the outside. VCF Proud Mary. Tizzy B. Hot. VCF Proud Mary makes it three in a row under Eddie Zuniga. Tizzy B. Hot second, then Discreet Kiss. Abby's Promise. In three, two, one. A lot of favorites scoring tonight. VCF Proud Mary, game winner. Three in a row for her, trained by Susan Anderson. Ridden by Eddie Zuniga, 322, 22, 10. Tizzy B. Hot just missed, ran second. Uh, four discreet kiss third. The double, 860. The exact, a 720. The try, 2330. The super, 8480. Dollar pick three, 1390. Pick four, 2180. Running time, 112 and three. Ninth race, 5,000 claimers, five and a half furlongs. The favorites, the five, Rocky Bear, and the one, Khaled again. And they're off. From between horses, that it's got to be us, Bling Boy. Moving through from the inside, Big Royal Deal. Then up from the outside, Indiana Charlie, followed by Rocky Bear. Down the back stretch. Big Royal Deal puts ahead in front. It's got to be us is second. Strike ahead moves up now, takes third. Bling Boy is fourth. Indiana Charlie fifth of length. Rocky Bear on the inside now runs a sixth. Then from the rail, Khalid again is next. Up between horses, Beaudry 23 and 1 for the quarter. Big Royal Deal with the head in front. Indiana Charlie on the outside. Up between horses. That strike ahead, then on the outside, Bling Boy, very well bunched still. On the inside, Big Royal Deal, Indiana Charlie. Bling Boy between those two, Cover Boy on the outside. It's Bling Boy with a head in front on the out, oh, gaining on the inside now, Beaudry, center of the track, Cover Boy. That's a photo. It looked like Bling Boy may have held on it. On the inside was Beaudry on the outside cover boy. Number seven, Bling Boy in a tight photo in the last under Diddy Elisorio. Cover boy up for second. Beaudry third. Uh, there's a look at uh, your prices. The winner paid 985.60 and 420. Running time 107 and 1.
Tomorrow, closing day, last day of the meet, post time, 110.